No more raw cookie dough? It's not a statement, it's a question mark. That is the warning from the Food and Drug Administration over concerns about E. coli in flour now. So it's not salmonella in raw eggs, now it's E. coli in raw flour. Let's bring in Kristen Tomlin. She is founder of Dough New York City. Kristen, good to see you. The, it's Cookie D O N Y C. That's your Twitter handle. We should point out. Yeah. Um, how do you get around this warning from the FDA? Yeah. So it's very important that the FDA is educating consumers about this risk. Um, for us at Doe, the health and safety of our customers is our top priority, and so that is why we use a heat-treated flour. So it's specifically manufactured for consumption. Um, it's a product by Ardent Mills, and it, it eliminates that risk of any foodborne illness or potential harmful bacteria that could be found in flour. Kristen, you have to point out, and we all have yeah. versions of it. I have the traditional, which I've already started eating. <laughs> and and I, I told Kristen in the break that I would pronounce it like Homer Simpson would. So, <laughs> don't! Don't! So wait, no, don't! No, I can, this don't. is dunk, dunk a do, right? So I can. Yeah, this is I her whole eat business, we should bake point it. Out. I could yes. eat it or bake it. Exactly. I have an option. You okay. have the option. I was a cookie dough lover, and I was on a quest to find a product um, that was safe to eat unbaked, but also bakeable, because customers like to have the option to do both. You can throw this into your ice cream. You can eat it oh with God. a spoon. Wow. It's well, really, you it's really delicious. Throw it in the it's oven you, and you, you, you make some awesome. actual cookies. Absolutely, it makes delicious cookies. So well, how you can, do you feel about the, F, the FDA coming out and? Making these big pronouncements about your business. Is, should the government get it, be getting involved? In, I mean, uh, I think it's important to educate people about the risks. Um, and I think if, if people are taking the companies are taking the proper precautions, and you know they shouldn't be serving food that's that's unsafe. So we've definitely done exactly that and making well, do you sure worry, that the products we eat are safe. But do you worry it'll hurt business though with people who are not, who just kind of blankly say, I can't eat raw cookie dough? I mean, I think there's definitely a risk in. Um, people just turning a blind eye and not eating any cookie dough. But my message is cookie dough is not necessarily created equal, but you can still mm -hmm. indulge in your, your favorite, you know, treat or childhood. So what are all the flavors? Yeah, so we have um, about 17 different flavors. Today I've brought for you um, our signature chocolate chip. We've got our steak and yeah. batter. Okay. That it's sounds delicious. Amazing. Yep, okay. you're eating one that is inspired kind of by a Dunkaroo, one of my childhood favorite treats. It's okay. called Dunkadoo. Okay. Um, we have <laughs> nuts for nuts. What do you Harlan got, got uh, cake batter, cake batter think, with oh. right now yeah. it has our red, white, and blue sprinkles in it. You've got <laughs> chocolate, chocolate dream, chocolate. which is kind of yeah. like a, a brownie batter, which mm -hmm. um, is really and fudgy and chocolatey and great. And no worries whatsoever. No worries, here. exactly. Oh, wow. Kristen, good. thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, and Kristen Tomlin of Go. <laughs> 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 my favorite, my favorite animated character would be Homer Simpson. <laughs>